Is BlackBerry gonna do the same thing as GameStop and AMC? Mm, it might. Okay, so I wanna talk about the obvious. You know, obviously, everyone has been in GameStop and everyone has moved over to AMC. There's still a lot of big plays going on right now in GameStop, obviously. But we know there's gonna be someone else joining the party here. And a lot of people expect BlackBerry to be that company. So obviously, BlackBerry is not a company that is killing it when it comes to tech, when it comes to finances. You know, this was a company that was pretty much on its way out in a lot of ways. But of course, it's a part of the whole Wall Street Bets movement. It's already had a pretty big day around January 27th, hitting just under $26, a bid price for that share. And then slowly since then, tapering down, and now we're sitting around a $14, $15 mark on BlackBerry. So obviously what everybody's wondering with this whole eight community, with this whole Wall Street Bets situation, how long is this gonna go and how bloody is this gonna get with just hedge funds, investors, common folk, and just guys that have a lot more money and stake in the game to where they can fight the big hedge funds, to where they can fight the big dogs. It's really interesting time if you are an investor. So with GameStop already hitting this $250 to $300 bid price, that's pretty much where it's playing around right now. The question is, how long can people in the so with GameStop having an average 250 to 300 bid price on it, the question is how long can the calls outweigh the puts and the puts outweigh the calls? Because you have to think and know, GameStop can go higher. It can honestly go higher. This can just be round one with GameStop. As crazy as that may sound, it can go higher. And right now we are in an AMC movement. We are waiting on AMC to really pop. That is happening right now. But we have to think there's gonna be another one to pop. And of course we have Nokia and we have Blackberry and Bed Bath & Beyond, but Blackberry has been one of the main ones that people are talking about nonstop. So it leads me to believe that it could be on the watch list with the ape community and you know it's gonna be the next big talk about thing with the Wall Street Bets articles coming out here. But when it comes to BlackBerry, there, this isn't a video where you know we're breaking down the finances of BlackBerry and like what they've done, their Q1 reports or Q2 reports. Like, they're not great. The reason the stock right now is sitting at a $14 bid price is because you have so many people hanging on to it just in case this does have a massive run on it. But think of this right now, from what we've already seen with GameStop, what we're seeing right now with AMC, and what could be potentially happening with BlackBerry. Think if all this were to continue to happen for another year. Think what that could look like if the stock could handle and stay at the price it's at right now and continue to grow. And more and more contracts, call options, imagine what could happen. And see, that's why when you see the comments, don't sell, just hold, hold, hold. That is what could happen here. If we were to hold this for an X amount of time, things could get even crazier here. Because know this, if you're new to the party here, GameStop is not worth $250, $300 a share price. It's not. This was a company that was on the verge of bankruptcy. They were honestly, like they were closing stores. It was not looking good, but it's still up. It's still sitting there because the ape community is still keeping this thing very strong. But friends, just look at this, know this. Around January, the same time BlackBerry shot up, AMC was in the dumpster too. This was not a company, this was not a stock that you like wanted to own. Things were not looking good, it was down in the dumps. Until we started hearing about this Wall Street Bets, Reddit community, you know, ape situation take over. And look at this, AMC had that shoot up around January. Then it kind of just, you know, just linger around this, you know, under, you know, $15 mark. And just recently, we've had the big boom. We've had the big pop. So I say that because BlackBerry has a very similar trail pattern right now. It's, it's kind of doing the same thing. So if you're new to the whole Wall Street bet situation, you know, becoming an ape, being in the ape community, you know, you will start to hear rumors about you know the next big moves that are going to happen. And me personally, the next one that I am watching is BlackBerry. I think BlackBerry could do something here because the situation of where BlackBerry is at financially and just overall with their technology. So with the GameStop and AMC stock right now, we are seeing some things start to come out with hedge funds, with big you know these big analysts, investors, these big Wall Street guys 
They are getting very upset. They are getting mad. And there is there, there's news articles everywhere. They are threatening investors, content creators, these big guys in the ape community. They are threatening them. It's getting pretty nasty here. But honestly, you know, I, I think it's going to get nastier. Just, you know, knowing human activity and knowing, you know, like that we really have not even seen the worst. Uh, you know what could happen here that's why i'm saying if this can last another year imagine what that would do to uh, so many puts so many hedge funds that you know are just they were betting on this stuff fall apart you know obviously a lot of the time sad to say you know the big hedge funds the big guys are always going to end up you know with their money some way somehow that's how they keep their money that's how they stay rich they there's always a loophole until it becomes illegal Friends, I hope you find that to be interesting news. I know I do. And I know a lot of us are just wondering, how much crazier is this whole ape reddit Wall Street bets community gonna get? It's, I think it's gonna get a lot worse. And when I say worse, I just mean threats from the big wigs. But friends, remember, be positive, beat you, take time to invest in your future. It is so important, and I will talk to you very soon. Leave me a comment, let me know what you're doing with this, what you think about what will be the next hit, or if this is all just gonna fade out and die away. Who knows? But friends, I will talk to you very soon. Bye-bye.